undefeated 2012 Ohio State Buckeyes! So I thought about what kind of recognition should this undefeated team have for the citizens of Columbus. And I thought about what powers I have as mayor. And so I said, you know what? I'm gonna name a street after this team. Take it down, rip off the sign. When you're undefeated, what do you do? You have the name of the street, 12 and 0 row. So here we are, 12 and 0, and we beat Michigan. Now that is perfection, isn't it? Hey, Mayor, thank you very much for, uh, thank you very much for 12 and 0 row. I'll put it in front of my house. So anyway. Uh... The journey started. Ohio State's had a great, great tradition, great years past. A new coaching staff comes in. There's some adversity, and it's a, really a blind leap of faith for them to follow a brand new coaching staff and maybe doing it a little different than it's been done in the past. Uh, there was a lot of resistance. There was a lot of pushback. Guys worked hard. However, they never really played with purpose. There was a bunch of guys out there went through spring practice. To be quite honest, we were very average, to maybe below average in a lot of areas. And then uh, we, our mission was real clear. We made it clear to our players we want to make the great state of Ohio proud. That mission was enhanced in the summer when we found out we had really something, we had purpose all of a sudden. That purpose was a great group of young men that didn't have to stay. We got hit with sanctions in December and every one of these young men, these senior class, they could have left. They're great human beings. I wasn't quite sure, we had a meeting and I wasn't quite sure why they stuck around. I recruited them really hard because I really didn't know them, but I wanted them back. I knew our chance to win because there's pretty good players in that class but I really didn't quite understand why they stayed. Throughout spring, our off season, spring practice, and summer, as we got ready to go play, it, I figured it out real quick. It's because this will go down as one of the great senior classes in Ohio State University history. This was so much fun tonight. How about we do it again next year?